up guys this is nw drift here and we are back with critical space program episode five now we have to start building our minimus space so maybe we can start with the lander can maybe uh put that on a uh, hitchhiker storage container we definitely need that what can we put here going that small now. Um, let's see, what else can we do? Is that enough? I think that's enough. Now let's add some solar panels to it and a radio dish. Where is the solar panels? There we go. Uh, like that. Hang on, they're now aligned. That, that's good enough. Now all we need is a, um, wait, a communitron. Let's see what this looks like. Looks pretty good. Yeah, that'll definitely work. Now what we need to do is, uh, hang on, maybe we can do it like, we can do like something like that. Yeah, like maybe we can do it like that. Like put that down there and, actually, <laughs> yeah, it looks good like that. Yeah, perfect. And then, maybe I can put one down. Oh my god, that looks great. Yes. Can I put a nose gun? No, I can't. Okay. Well, let's put on the engine now. Now, since a um, Minmus is very lo has very low gravity, will these work? Yeah, they'll work. Now, I want three... Yeah, that's three. Uh, three docking ports. I don't want to obstruct the, um, hatch, though. That'll work? Yeah, that'll work. And then, where are we going to put the landing legs? Now, this is a very important factor for base building. We need to know how high your landing legs are, and how high the other craft, how high the other landing legs have to be. Like that? Yeah, that seems good. Yeah. Okay. Now we just need to... Uh, let me just lower them to get, like, a pers get a good view. Those, those docking boards do seem pretty high, though. Let's lower them a little bit. That seemed good, yeah, but it seems like the fuel tank and the landing legs in the way now. See, it's... Oh! very important thing you have to do when it comes to this type of stuff. Does that work? See, the thing is, if I move one the other way, it'll get in front of the other one. Aw, oh, dang it, um. Why don't- here, no, 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 here's what we're gonna do. Why don't we add two for now? And then... We will attach a hub later. Yeah. Yeah, that, that'll work. Now what we need to do is get a transfer stage. Where's, where's the small decoupler? And when I mean small, I mean small. Now what we do is get a massive girder stick. Oh, get out of here with the four. Put that there. Then that there, and then a massive, I'm gonna have to move this up, then a massive fuel tank, then a massive, a massive engine, then a massive decoupler, then move, move more, it's not gonna be that big, I usually use this design for, um, uh, these type of things, oh, another big engine, medium engine, does this even count as tiny? It's still pretty big. Then we need a powerful engine. Something like that. Then no, we don't need to move down anymore. Uh, however, I'm not done. Now, where's the boosters? Oh, wait, hang on a second. Uh, no, no. It's too powerful. Oh, I, I 
think I think that'll work. I'm gonna attach RCS. because well because it's big so and we'll put a ton like that oh my god I never put this many RCS thrusters ever like ever uh, now we just gotta attach some struts oh wait no no I forgot I oh I keep almost forgetting the most important thing of space travel always have your batteries now all we need is struts. Okay. Make sure these things are tightened now. Okay. Uh, let's do one more for good measure. Great. Perfect. Now all we need is... Now, usually this happens sometimes, so what I usually do is I do this, and then what I do is I attach struts to here and then I attach struts onto the top and then do that to make it slightly less wiggly uh, that should be all the struts right still could be pretty weak wiggly though I'll do like something like that and then just in case we'll do like two because I don't want them to get in the way of the solar panels like, like that. That should be good. Okay. Now let's name it. Miss Base uh, Center Mars. Also, I might do a Beam G Drive video. Uh, just tell me if that's a good idea. Now what we're gonna do is... Oh. No. Oh wait. You gotta be kidding me. Okay, perfect. So, when this separates, then we have, that's gonna fire. Okay, good. Um, that engine's there. Let's, okay. And then, what we, what we want is those to be like that. Uh, we're not done yet. Mm -mm. We just need these. Also, since we, um, finished the spacecraft last episode, we don't have to build that anymore. However, we will have to do some even harder docking since we're like that. Yeah, it's gonna be pretty hard. Uh, I think we can save now and get ready for launch. Just cracking. Okay, let's see who we got. Yeah, Merkin and Hadblack. I never heard of that. Also, the even harder thing is that since I can't, like, see how far away uh, a certain craft is because it's just been trolling me lately, uh, it's gonna be hard docking. Trust me. It is. In fact, really, really hard. I don't even know. Like, it, it shows, but... I mean, it even shows up on my map, even. But... I, I, don't, I don't know why, but... I think we should start launching right now. The... You have to start launching as, like, just like, it's just like the moon. Just slightly long. Alright, we're off. Once again, I always, I always use this craft, so... It should be 100% successful, right? Like... Not the fastest, but it'll get the job done. It, it, it does go pretty fast when it um, hits this stage, but that depends on the payload. And they look scared already. Wait. And... Chest explodes. Okay. Time to roll. Oh, 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 no. 
get ready for step. And just in case, stop skimming my rocket. Oh, I think it overheated. Okay, let's go. And we're just about to run out in that tank. Oh wait, now we just gotta go onto that tank. This thing burns fuel like a monster. Let's keep chugging. Come on, guys. I can believe in you. You can head to Minmus. You know, there was, um, you know how people say, uh, Minmus is the easiest planet to get to? Well, there was a time where I only used, no, known how to go to the moon, but never back. Uh, well, I thought Minmus was going, well, going to Minmus was hard because of it, of its inclination orbit. How and how much of a noob was I? That's a rhetorical question. Okay, we're about to burn out in this one. I swear it's like a hundred gallons a second. All right, and now this engine has tended to overheat in these conditions, but once again, I think we'll be okay. Let's just focus on getting to Minmus. I can see a little bit of wobble. Yes, yeah, see overheat. Okay. And there's the moon. This stage always reminded me of uh, the Saturn V stage, the third stage, I believe. Oh, I almost forgot about the overheat. I actually, I don't think it overheats. I've been, I've used this craft many times, but I don't think it ever overheated. I'll keep an eye on it just in case, but... We probably carried this mono for no reason, haven't we? Oh, right. Yeah, we're not doing an orbit, we're just going straight there. Beautiful. Oh, I hate that camera. Get get out of here. If I'm like in the outer solar system, then I'll definitely use it. But now, mm, nah. Oh, we're not going to the moon now. Oh, we gotta. Now, since the oh dang it. Oh yeah, that's not gonna work. Uh, we're gonna have to move. Oh wow. That's, that's a lot of mono being burned. Uh, we just have to make a small, uh, small course correction. Whoa, slow down, slow down, slow down. Actually, you know what? No, I'm not gonna slow down. You wanna know why? Just a waste of mono. Perfect. Now, I won't extend the solar panels until we land because we got these infinite batteries. So technically, I use solar panels for show. <laughs> Just wait until we get close to the encounter. That's pretty slow for an orbit. I mean, we are pretty high, so that would make sense. Alright, we are currently three days, three days away from the encounter. Yeah, you'll be staying a lot longer. Look at how fast that's going, though. Okay. And we're in an encounter. Great. Uh, see, like this is when I use the um, this type of camera. It helps me when I'm further out, but not when I'm in an orbit. It's a little confusing, but uh, once again, even more concentration. And well, not exactly, since that was a little hard docking, and all I have to do was land, right? Now, I'm looking to land somewhere with ice where it's flat. That's the easiest place to land. Uh, 9,000 should be good. I can't see from here. 
9,000 is pretty high for a Mimnus Orbit, to be honest. Well, not pretty high, but... Now I gotta get ready for... Uh... To get into an Orbit Burn, or however you call it. I don't know how to call it. Alright. Now let's just... Warp until we get there. Two days! That's a lot. Also, I haven't ever quick saved, so this might be a good idea to quick save right now. Yeah. Okay. We're so close to Periapsis. Oh, seven minutes six. I love that noise. It's so peaceful. Oh wow, we're closer than I remembered. Okay. Okay, we're getting set up for our burn to get into an orbit. Okay. Uh, once we hit the five second marker, we will start burning. really easy to get into an orbit with this thing. That's good. 9,856. That's actually pretty close. It's so close, it's dancing. Oh, no, no, it isn't. I look away for one second. Now I switch. See? See how it helps me? Yeah, we're not looking to land there or there. Or... We're looking to land on ice. Now, as stupid as it sounds, it's actually flat, and you can't break ice, so... Well, in this game, at least. Maybe we can land in that patch over there? We are, are going to, um, cross over a bigger patch of ice. Yeah, we, we... It's not even going over it anymore, yeah. We're definitely going there. I should start, um... Uh, I... Soon I should start, um... Burning retrograde. And how much fuel we got? 908. So technically, if we went full throttle at this thing, we would have 9 seconds of fuel. But since it's still, the gravity is slow, so slow, I mean, so low, we wouldn't have a problem. So. exactly there, but I'm doing it a little further so that we have more space to land. Believe it or not, I have never, ever touched the, um, real surface of Minmus. Okay, we're not gonna go near the surface, that's good. Also, I should turn a little bit. Oh, my keyboard. Okay. There we go. Uh, like that. Yeah, that's good. Still slightly over there. Okay, now we're over the ice. Now we should start um slowing down. debris to come from this so that we have enough space to dock. Okay, just burn a little more. Yeah, I've always landed like this. Just kept burning and burning and burning. I always wanted to, um, like, burn all at once, but I always never did. It's just a habit by now. Well, since it's ice, 
it count as sea level, so that's another advantage to landing on Minmus with ice. I'll just put out the gears now, just in case. Well, not just in case, but like, to prepare for landing. I think I can see start seeing the particles of the um of the ground. How much fuel we got? 90 gallons in that. Uh we still got tons of fuel in this, so Oh I see our shadow. Where the mouse is. You see the shadow? Okay, so it's right over. Alright, I'm gonna sit right now. Bye bye. Oh, we might as well turn off the RCS since we don't have any more. Well, well, we do actually, but um, we don't have any on the um, on the th any thrusters here. Okay. Shouldn't be talking when I'm trying to land. Wait, why am I still looking at the map? So close. Should take a boom in a couple of seconds. And now, oh, oh, it looks like we have a little bit of debris. But you see what I mean? It's not even showing how far away it is. We should um divert. We should move away from the debris a little bit. Gosh, this landing is taking forever, isn't it? I, I see another debris and it's exploded. <laughs> I'm gonna rotate a little bit more so that when we dock, the debris isn't in the way. All right, boys, I think we're here. It took like, it took like a week and a half to get here. Oh, why are you exploding now? Better not explode when I land, oh my god. Oh my god, stop, you're scaring me. Okay. Okay. So close. Ah, oh, I could. Come on. Okay, we're starting to send a little bit. Oh, okay. We're so close. I'm so paran- I'm such a paranoia. <gasps> Stay. First landing. Oh, wait. Time to- Quickly. Time to extend the panels. And the communitron. Come on, communitron. Extend. There we go. Now I, I will quick save again. Now that since we have some- extra fuel if you want to say this this can be a fuel tank i'm gonna shut them down just in case any accidents happen you never know what can happen in space travel let's be honest all right guys let's plant the let's plant the flag and then i guess we'll end the video off here and i forgot a ladder not that it matters but once again, style points, am I right? Uh, we will, um, we will, um, investigate that a a later. Or, technically, next episode. Yes, the flag. And will it be up? Yes! Finally! It looks good. Okay. Well, it it's in the right position. Uh, men must base. Oh, not, not bay. Oh wait, 
If you did enjoy this video, give it a like. If you didn't, look how happy he is. Look, he wants to like this video. How much you wanna bet? All right. If you did enjoy this video, give it a like. If you didn't give it a dislike, well, please tell me why. We will record another episode tomorrow. Bye bye.